so there is a QA session for 15 minutes. So you can raise your hand and ask questions to presenters. 1269 IRCM Institute. Yes. So, uh, what is the, the meaning of semaphore in IPC mechanism? Semaphore that is our said variable. Means, uh, if you had that operating system course, maybe you all know. That is shared variable between the two different processes. So, like mutex, if you have heard about that uh, mutex, that is a semaphore, that is the shared variable and that is used for uh, to entering the critical section. Double one, double four, KCB Technical Academy Indoor. In Akash tablet, we are, we are just using Android operating system. Okay. Yeah, so? so, can you tell me some limitations? So, uh, See, the Akash tablet has version ICS, that's ice cream sandwich. Okay, so I mean, exactly uh, whatever application or whatever is supported till ICS, that will only work on Akash tablet. I mean, that's the only limitation we have. Because there is an upgraded version which is 4.1 Jelly Bean. We don't have it on Akash tablet. We have 4.0 ICS. So whatever limitation, advantages, disadvantages are related to ICS, those are applicable to Akash tablet. That's it. Thank you. One double two nine, Sardar Patel Institute. So I want to ask that what does actually surface and audio flinger does in audio uh, this Android runtime process? Means uh, you want to know that surface flinger and audio flinger, huh? So that is your miss. Like they are manager, they are managing uh, like audio audio flinger. That is managing the control of the speaker and your headphone of, of your device, right? And surface flinger is uh, your surface. Like uh, as I mentioned, if you are seeing if you are seeing that uh, battery status or maybe your uh, tower uh, network range, etc. All are displayed by the application. That application will communicate to the sur uh, surface flinger to display it. So now you are watching that thing and you, if you start the some uh, another application, okay. So both, this both two application, it will contact to the surface flinger and at a time you, you can see both thing at a time because of the, that, that is the task of the surface flinger and uh, uh, audio flinger that is your, uh, if you are uh, started a music on your tablet. So at that time that audio flinger will contact to the, uh, connect with the speaker and uh, you are able to listen it software hardware interface or it provides any audio platform to run audio files? Audio file means, uh, look uh, this main purpose of audio flinger it will contact to the driver and it will which will contact to the hardware right so means uh, it's not like uh, what do we say uh, we are not providing uh, it is uh, just an interface to contact to the hardware only I am not sure about that, but uh, if you are cutting off power, so how can your process will get run? 1271 Jawaharlal Nehru National College of Engineering, Karnataka. Explain about the parental control uh, uh, over the application regarding the uh, using Android. So how, how the parental control can be achieved without the knowledge of this uh, Android? So how the parents can modify? the application so and how the uh, in order to block the SMS inside the college the running the application regarding the usage of internet means web based application such as Facebook or browsing such type of application so how can you avoid the uh, access to those applications uh, can you answer sir I didn't get your complete uh, question completely, but uh, from what I got, your question is uh, there are some applications which you want to restrict, and some applications which shouldn't be uh, in the bl blacklist. Is that correct? Without any knowledge of the application to the parents, is it possible? So, what type of user interface you are providing to the parents to get the parental control? No, no. So. So for the parents, they'll have to know which applications are installed in the tablet and after that only they'll be able to uh, write the policies. So if there are 10 applications which are installed in the tablet, then the parents will have to know that 
these applications are relevant for the students and these applications are gaming applications so all the gaming applications or any say messaging applications that can be blocked uh, by writing a policy